channel. Um, today it is uh, it's Saturday, and uh, I am going to uh, take a break from uh, the usual crap. <laughs> crap all. Um, I am going to. I mean, next week during the weekdays, it's going to be back to business as usual. Um, it's going to be uh, Warcraft 2: Ties of Darkness. And of course, tomorrow is 8 bit fun day. So, I am going to uh, play, play an NES classic tomorrow. I'm not really that sure, like, what I'm supposed to, what I'm gonna play tomorrow. We'll see. I have done, like, uh, a lot of uh, Super Mario Brothers <coughs> uh, games this, uh, these uh, last these past few weeks, uh, but I don't know, I, I'm, I'm thinking I want some variety. I usually try to uh, stream, like, even though I like consistency, uh, I kind of want to explore other games as well. I don't want to, like, end up in the same rut, you know? Um, so, uh, I don't know, we'll, we'll see. Even though I should actually be uh, playing Super Mario Bros. 3 if I want to maintain consistency. So, uh, we'll, but I don't know because that's a very, very long game. Um, I'm, I'm unsure as of yet. But today we are going to uh, begin our uh, adventures in uh, rediscovering the old classics, the old point and click LucasArts games. And it's going to be. Uh, this one is going to be my first LucasArts game ever, actually, and it is going to be The Secret of Monkey Island. Hey, Freppis is online! Welcome back, Freppis. You are always welcome here. Now, before we begin, I'm just going to uh, advertise my channel. Quick, uh... Yeah. So, um, just, you know, to notify people that I am actually streaming. <laughs> so, <clears throat> so Freppis, how's your uh, day been? And how was your uh, Friday? Let's see. I was actually out celebrating, or like, toasting Molly because she's moving out of town pretty soon. So... It was sort of like the last night with the old crew, you know? Uh, <clears throat> be gone, be gone, be gone. Alright. There we go. Okay. Alright. Hey! There I can go. see myself. Alright. Okay. Okay. So, let's uh, go over to the game, shall we? Let's start it up first and foremost. <clears throat> now it's gonna lag a little while it's loading. Oh, we're past that now. Alright, here we go. Ah. Alright, so. Alright, oh, yeah, that's right. You were supposed to uh, watch Transformers the last night. Um, was it any good? The, uh, the movie. I haven't seen it yet, so don't spoil anything. Alright, let's play the new game. <laughs> they deceive us with this. This old... The old version of the game. Deep in the Caribbean. The island of Melee. Man, this is nostalgia for me. To me. Look, and then... <laughs> Secret of Monkey Island. Special Edition. Like, I was wondering... I was uh, kind of debating with myself whether or not I should play the original one. Because I actually had the CDs. But... I figured, nah, let's do this. Because I bought these... Both uh, Monkey Island 1 and 2 uh, lately... I bought them pretty recently uh, over uh, GOG, so I figured, why not? Do, do, do. 
Now, for anybody new to this, to these games, these games are hilarious. I mean, they have the humor that is, uh, it's, uh, it's rare to see, uh, this kind of hum humor in, in, um, in games. Ron Gilbert was a master at this. That's kind of on the... Yeah, the first Transformers movie is always going to be, like, the best one. I mean, and that and that's not really saying that much, because it's not really that great, but it is definitely the best of the of all of them. Alright, so here's Guybrush Threepwood. Hi, my name's Guybrush Threepwood, and I want to be a pirate. Yikes! <laughs> Don't sneak up on me like that. <coughs> um... I'm over this way. Ah, well then, Thriftweed. Threepwood. Guybrush Threepwood. I see. So, you want to be a pirate, eh? You look more yes. like a flooring inspector. <laughs> but if you're serious about pirating, go talk to the pirate leaders. You'll find them in the scum bar. Gosh, thanks. I'll do that. <laughs> Bye now. I'm off to seek my fortune. Good luck. All right, so you start with this kind of a um, kind of blank what slate. Did you say those pirate leaders were? <laughs> the scum bar. Right. Thanks. That actually sounds like. What is his name? I f I don't remember. Part one: the three trials. Um, now as I said. This this is kind of cool because y you don't really see this. I mean, usually in games today, uh, a main character has like uh, already an already set backstory and whatnot. When you start Monkey Island One, you are a complete blank slate with only one thing, and it's your ambition to become a pirate. And that's pretty. That's a pretty good way to start because. Uh, you don't really have to know anything else. You don't have to know anything about Guybrush, um, Guybrush's uh, uh, past or anything. I do. Th he does uh, reveal some things, some humorous things uh, as the games progress. But more than that, it, it's you don't really need to to do anything. Okay, you don't really need to know anything. Now, uh, this is not a speed run, of course. I just want to remind you, so this is going to be casual, and I invite you to join me on this adventure. Re-elect Governor Marley. When there's only one candidate, there's only one choice. <laughs> oh. By the way, um, tell me if uh, like the volume is good or not, Just so, just so I know. Scumbar. Always want to close doors. Like I'm stuck with that since uh, since uh, Outlast. Now, and actually, I I always did that in uh, Lucas Arts games as well. I always find it kind of cool that you could actually take the time to close the doors. And in some games, that is something you need to do because there's something like stuck on the door, on the back side of the door that you have to get. So. Um, yeah. I don't think it's wise to wake a sleeping pirate. <laughs> All right, let's talk to that guy. It's always him. Ahoy there, stranger. Okay, you good. Down? Um, yeah, I guess we should tell him that I'm new in town. My name's Guybrush Threepwood. I'm new in town. Guybrush Threepwood. <laughs> <laughs> That's the stupidest name I've ever heard. Oh. Uh, well, what's your name then? Well, what's your name? My name is Mancom Seapwood. <laughs> so, what brings you to Melee Island, anyway? Yeah, and the trademark. Uh, I want to be a pirate. I want to be a pirate. 
You should go talk to the important looking pirates in the next room. They're right. pretty much in charge around here. They can tell you where to go and what to do. That's good. What can I find the governor? Well, we don't need to know that yet. Nice talking to you. Nice talking to you. Have fun on Melee Island. Trademark. <laughs> Alright, um. Why are there black bars up here? And down here as well, huh? Weird. Okay, um, let's see. Yeah, this guy is pretty interesting as well. What are you looking at me for? Um, nah. Sorry to bother you. Bye. We don't need to talk to him. Right. Like, mo many characters are like just filler characters. But they're pretty interesting to talk to. But we don't really need to talk to them. Uh, although this one I do want to talk to. Hi. Hi yourself. Hi. Nice hat. Hi. <laughs> well, and then, I mean, ask me about Loom, it says. All right. So, tell me about Loom. You mean the latest masterpiece of fantasy storytelling from Lucasfilm's Brian Moriarty? Why, it's an extraordinary adventure with an interface of magic. Stunning, high-resolution 3D landscape. Yeah, right. Sophisticated score and musical effects. Have you guys played Loom? The detailed animation and special effects, elegant point-and-click control of characters, objects and magic spells <laughs> beat the rush go out and buy loom today <laughs> what an obvious sales pitch Jeez, what an obvious sales pitch sorry but on some topics i just get carried away all right nice talking to you hi <laughs> all right let's uh oh i think i can talk to Let's talk to the... I think a dog. We're supposed to be able to talk to the dog. Ah. And we can... <laughs> Woof. Woof. <laughs> they actually put this in the game. <laughs> With the voice actors. A voice actor doing the dog. He's actually, you never think about that, but but uh, he's actually uh, giving away like a plot element in that. If you if you've played this game before, you know you know uh, what he's re what the dog is referring to. All right, so let's talk to these uh, big pirates. Uh, I'm also gonna um, my plans for tonight are actually to uh, stream as much as I can uh, for as long as I can. Uh, I'm gonna stream, uh, like, yeah. I mean, that's basically what I'm gonna, gonna do because I was out last night. So tonight it's just gonna be a chill stream night. And uh, Freppa is probably gonna be with me uh, as long as he can. <laughs> All right. How do how do you switch? Um, oh. You do. You switch with the scroll. What be ye wanting, boy? That's not look. <laughs> I mean to kill you all. I want to be a fireman. <laughs> I want to be a pirate. I want to be a pirate. So what? Why bother us? Hey, don't forget we're short on help because of this holy chuck thing. So. So, no pirates means no swag, and no swag means no grog. That guy. Dangerously low on grog. 
the voice actor that does uh, the pirate to the right. He, that's the same. My breath for ten minutes. That's the same voice actor that does uh, LeChuck. The trial, uh, the three trials. Ow! Uh, <laughs> what three trials are those? There are three trials every pirate must pass. You must master the sword. One. And the art of thievery. Two. And the quest. The quest. What? <laughs> Treasure hunting is here to Hey, Banana Brain, welcome back! It's always nice to see you here. Each of these three areas. Sword play, thievery, and a, a treasure huntery. Treasure huntery. Turn with proof that you've done it. <laughs> Is that even a word? Hey, treasure huntery? You must drink grog with us. Yes, grog. <laughs> All right, we might as well get some more information. First of all, tell me about mastering the sword. Tell me more about mastering the sword. First, get here your sword. You must of course. seek out and defeat the sword master. Okay. Someone in town can probably direct you. <laughs> oh, you want to find somebody to train you first. True. <laughs> Imagine trying to take on a sword master without any training. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Uh, thievery. Tell me more about mastering the art of thievery. We want you to procure a small item for us. The idol of many hands. In the governor's <laughs> mansion. The governor keeps the idol of many hands. I take that as a... Compliment. <laughs> You'll have to get past the guards. The tricky part will be getting past the dogs outside. Oh yeah, the poodles. They might be able to drug him or something. All right, and tell me more about treasure hunting. Tell me more about treasure hunting. Legend has it that there's a treasure buried here on the island. All you must do is find the legendary lost treasure of Melee and bring it back. Okay. Should I have a map or something? Yes, you should. Well, you can hardly expect to find a treasure without a map. And don't forget, X marks the spot. <laughs> I mean, I think you've had a little too much grog there, but buckos. Um. <laughs> What's in that grog stuff anyway? What's in that grog stuff anyway? Grog is a secret mixture which contains one or more. Yeah, this this is fun. Kerosene, propylene glycol, artificial sweeteners, sulfuric acid. What? Rum, acetone, red dye number two, <laughs> scum, axle grease, axle grease, battery acid. <laughs> Or pepperoni, as you can probably imagine, it's one of the most caustic, volatile substances known to man. And you're drinking it. The stuff eats right through these mugs, and the cook is losing a fortune replacing them. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'll just be running along now. Uh... Leave us to our grog. Come back later and tell us how you're doing. <laughs> All right, so we've been given three trials uh, to perform. I will say, I I might as well say, uh, t uh, tell you that um, uh, this is a game that I am intimately familiar with. I don't necessarily think I'm gonna finish it quickly, but I did play it like a year ago. Uh, no one knows with me. You're just too cute sometimes. Um, all right, we might as well. Hey, you can't come back here. Right, 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 right. We'll have to wait until, because I think we're supposed to get some things from the kitchen. Hey, ah, crap. Don't go into the kitchen. Okay, I won't. Eh. 
Go, 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 go. Close. Close. Get that. It's some sort of meat or meat like substance. No. Pick up. Pick up. That, thank you. Um, pot. Pick up the pot. Where's the pick up? Eh. And open the door. And do this. <laughs> Stop. You make. You'll make me blush. Go over here. Bounce. Uh, bounce the seagull. Bounce it again. And pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. Ah! Crap. Hold on. Hold on. I can't move it. Oh. <laughs> okay. Okay. Hold on. Um, why didn't they have, like, pick up by, by the walk? Wait, 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 wait. Up is close. Push, put, okay. So, pull, give. Okay, three down. That's... Stop it! <laughs> You're really making me blush now. Uh, one, two, three. I think it's a herring. I can't move it. What? Of course you can. Oh, it's supposed to be. Uh, okay, maybe there's like hotkeys for the. Um, yeah, okay, thank you. Okay, so we are supposed to. Now let's see if we can... How do you open the inventory? No, that's not the... I, maybe. Yeah, that's the inventory. Alright, good. Um, I do think we're supposed to... Um, <laughs> I think... It's some sort of meat or yeah, I know, I know. Like substance. You sunk meat with pot of stew, I think. That's good. And it's stewed. Pick up meat and stew. No. Got it. Now we have stewed meat. Now we have everything we're supposed to get from the kitchen at least. And uh, uh with the exception It's some sort of meat or uh with meat. the exception of uh the grog, but that'll come in handy later. Or that is a necessity later. Alright, so let's get out of here. Oh, hold on. Close the door. <laughs> because I always want to do that. After Outlast, where you close doors constantly. Alright. Let's get out of here. Meanwhile, <gasps> deep beneath Monkey Island, the ghost pirate LeChuck ship lies anchored in a river of lava. That's Rob Paulson. Rob Paulson. There's nothing like the hot winds of hell blowing in your face. <laughs> no, sir. Nothing like it. <laughs> the skeleton. Yeah. Uh, the first thing. Sir. I. It's days like this that make you glad to be dead. Oh, yes, sir. Glad to be dead. <laughs> you are glad to be dead, right? Oh, yes, sir. I, I feel so lucky that you happened to capture my ship that murdered me and everyone on board. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, sir. Lucky. Good lucky. To hear it. Now, what was it you disturbed me for? Uh, y yes, sir. Well, you see, we might have a problem on Melee Island. Problem? What possible problem could there be? I've got those sissy pirates so scared of the sea, they're afraid to take a bath. Oh, LeChuck, you don't know. There seems to be a new pirate in town. <gasps> Actually, he's a pirate wannabe. Young, inexperienced, probably nothing to worry about. Don't know why I bother you in it. <laughs> <laughs> I'll have him taken care of myself. Wait! I'll handle this. 
personally. Aha! My plans are too important to be messed up by amateurs. Yes, sir. All right. So, oh, uh, what I've been doing today? Uh, actually, I was very slow today because I was out yesterday. I was out celebrating my my uh, friend. I was gonna say girlfriend, but then I remembered she's not my girlfriend. She's a friend that is a girl. Uh, I s I was kind of um, we were having a la last get together before she moves to another town. So I uh, woke up pretty late today because I was kind of I was a little hungover. Um, but yeah, you know. So I haven't I've oh I've done my laundry. That's basically it. And then I want. Uh, then I tried to uh, set up the stream. For some reason, the game capture wouldn't work at first. Uh, what about you, Banana Brain? What have you done? Let's see. Excuse me, but do you have a cousin named Sven? <laughs> no, but I once had a barber named. No, but I once had a barber named Dominique. <laughs> Close enough. <laughs> Let's talk business. You want to buy a map to the legendary lost treasure of Melee Island? Only one in existence. Rare. Very rare. Rare. <laughs> Very rare. Only 100 pieces of eight. <gasps> you bastard! Uh, I don't have enough money. No thanks. I don't have enough money. Well then, buzz off, kid. It's bad for business. All right. Fine. Let's see. Hey, don't mess with my rat. <laughs> I said don't pester the rat. Oh, just because I moved the the uh, cursor over the rat. I'm not gonna warn you again. I'm not Leave even. Leave the rat alone. I'm not even clicking it or anything. Hey, man. Frank, make him quit it. Oh, now look what you did. Oh, I scared off his rat. <laughs> uh, oh, you've gone for a swim. Okay. Yeah, I know. The, it, it can be rough trying to set up OBS on, on uh, laptops, I think. I think I've seen something about that on the net, although I I haven't tried that myself. <coughs> Sorry about the rat. Do you like rats? <laughs> <laughs> yes, I love rats. No, I can't stand them. Yes, especially in a light wine sauce. That's so cruel. Let's go for it. Yes, especially in a light wine sauce. <laughs> Get away! <laughs> um. What are you looking at? <laughs> okay. Um. Say, are you guys pirates? No, we're a wandering circus troop. <laughs> but some <laughs> idiot chased our train <laughs> rat away. <laughs> Uh, shut up! <laughs> of course we're pirates! You can't buy clothes like these off the rack! What do you want? What's in the keg? Rum. Jam. <laughs> jam. Uh, rum! <laughs> uh, rum and jam. It's an old pirate favorite, everybody knows that! Uh, rum and jam. Do you guys know the sneaky looking man on the opposite corner? Wanna buy a map, eh? Our maps are top quality, not like the bird caged liners you get from that clown across the street. <laughs> no, just kidding. These are actually copies of the minutes of the last meeting of the Melee Island PTA. <laughs> Can't even give them away. <laughs> <laughs> Want one? Um, 
No, but I'll take one if you give me two pieces of eight. No, but I'll take one if you give me two pieces of eight. <laughs> okay, that's fair. <laughs> Uh, I apologize for what I said about rats. Might as well. They're very intelligent creatures. <laughs> What's his problem? More intelligent than him. <laughs> Why, there's a story around these parts that a bunch of rats actually crewed a ship here from fabled Monkey Island. Aha. Oh, no, that's not right. It was actually a group of monkeys. Yep. Ah, it's better than the common part here. Ah, it's not for common parts. From camera, must be some way out to find. Ha 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 ha! Well, a lot of people do that. I mean, and uh, your face uh, is probably enough for a lot of followers. Um, as for the gaming window, that is exactly how it was for me. Or actually, no, it didn't show up at all. Um, I don't really know how I fixed it. But I think you need to, like, activate... You need to have your game window activated. I mean, you need to click on so that the game comes up. I mean, full screen. That's when you see uh, the game window, I think. I think that was some... Kind of how, how I did it. Uh, that's that's amazing. But true. <laughs> when they arrived, they sold the ship for a pretty penny. Only time I've seen anyone get the better of old Stan in a day. Oh, I love Stan. <laughs> Stan is so cool. I thought it was rats. And he's a recurring character that actually appears in, uh, I think, all of the subsequent games. I think he's a fan favorite. Um, Alright. I'll just be running along now. Alright, let's uh, meet the voodoo lady. By the way, when I was a kid, I always wanted to. I always like uh, opened every door to f see, like to see where, uh, um, where I would end up. Like, like uh, if I would end up in a room, like in the scum bar and whatnot. But in this town, uh, most doors are fake because if you open them. You come out another door. You see? Uh, but this one is not. Wait, what? There's a problem from here. Okay. If you say so. All right. Now. It's time for the voodoo lady. No thanks. I'd rather not touch any of this creepy voodoo stuff. Uh, let's see. There's a jar of bat drippings. A box that says assorted scales. <laughs> a shaker full of monkey flakes. And some cat knuckles. Cat knuckles? <laughs> How barbaric! Looks comfortable in a spooky sort of way. Uh, I think I hear slithering inside. Gee, I wonder what's in these baskets. Hey, a chicken with a pulley in the middle. Hmm, a rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle. What possible use could that have? Yeah, let's not get overwhelmed by this extreme foreshadowing, you know. No, pick up chicken. Maybe no one will miss just this one thing. Um. Poor little thing. Whatever it was. Now this is the cup of a carpenter. Huh. <laughs> All right, here we go. What the hell? Oh, it was because. Uh, what may I help you with, sir? I kind of clicked outside the game, I think. <laughs> okay. Um, let me see. My name is Guybrush Threepo. This is this is when they first meet. This is actually epic if you know the monk. 
if you already have played the Monkey Island, like all of the games. She's always gonna be like his ally in a way, I think. Wait. Don't say anything. I can sense your name is is Guybrush. Guybrush knows hair. No. Threepwood. Guybrush Threepwood. Am I not right? <laughs> Wow, that was amazing. Do you know any other tricks? I do not deal in tricks. Oh, really? What I know is the truth. Uh, ah, yeah. I sense the guilt of stealing my chicken grows. <laughs> Take it. It's yours. Why don't you want it? Is it jinxed with an ancient voodoo curse? No. <laughs> the pulley squeaks. <laughs> Okay. So, your <laughs> mind reading skills tell me it is your future you are interested in. Are you certain this is something you really wish to know? So, these things she's going to tell me, we, we're going to have to remember them because everything she says is actually going to happen in the game at one point or another. Uh, yes. Yes, <clears throat> everything is going to happen to me. I am getting a vision. I see you Ooh. taking a voyage. A long voyage. I see you captaining a ship. Yeah! I see... What? See what? I see a giant monkey. Yikes! I see you inside the giant monkey. Gross. <laughs> Wait. It's all becoming clear. Your journey will have many parts. You will see things better left unseen. You will hear things better left unheard. You will learn things better left unlearned. Although that kind of things. Uh, that I don't I get. I hate surprises. I still no. Forget. The time is not right to know. When you know your purpose, come see me. I will let you know then. Okay. Whoa! Yikes! Bad acid. <laughs> I'm just gonna look at these. Poor chickens. <laughs> I love the fact that in LucasArts games, they actually took the time to record voiceovers for, like, completely useless stuff. Like, looking at things and that has nothing to do with the game. That has to be, like, very tedious. I mean, especially for the voice actors. Or maybe, no, it's just a job to them, of course, but I mean... Yeah, whatever. Ahoy there, fancy pants. Um, I don't think I'm supposed to be here yet. I can't really buy anything. Oh, yeah, that's I know, I know. What do you want? <coughs> I think I'd just like to browse. Okay. Wake me up if you need anything. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. You're supposed to... What do you want? I'm looking for the Swordmaster of Melee Island. The Swordmaster of Melee Island? Hmm. Now, I don't know. See, nobody knows the whereabouts of her secret hideout. Nobody except me. I'd have to go and ask her if it's okay to show you the way. Hmm. I guess I could hike all the way over there. Once. Be right back. Yeah, right. Once. And don't touch anything! Okay. Ring bell for service. Now, this is fun, because you can actually... Uh, you can actually pick up the sword. I mean, take the sword. Slash master. When you want a sword as sharp as your wit. <laughs> Thank you. And I need the, sh the shovel. <coughs> I 
And, of course, we're going to have to get into the uh, vault as well at some point. Now, I wonder... Gotcha, you little thief. <laughs> Maybe you'd like to pay for those. Um. About this sword. Yeah, what about it? I want it. That's a hundred pieces of eight. Okay, so we got the Take price for the it. sword. One hundred pieces of eight. I don't, I have, don't enough have enough money. money. Figures. Now, how else do you want to waste my time? About this shovel. Yeah, what about it? I want it. <laughs> oh, another would-be treasure hunter, eh? Yeah. That'll cost you 75 pieces of eight. All right, so 175 pieces of eight for the store. 75 pieces <coughs> of eight? <coughs> I don't have that much. Then you better go put it back. <laughs> So, Banana Brain, how uh, how was your Friday? What did you do last night? Do 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 or yesterday? Is there something here that maybe you can afford? Uh, no, I nah. think I'd just like to browse. Oh, be my guest, fancy pants. But it's so weird because. I know you're supposed to get a uh, roll of breath mints from him. I don't remember w how you get them. Don't think, just buy. What do you think this is, a museum? Wait, 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 wait. Uh, Did come in here to get out of the cold or do you actually need something <laughs> open uh, looks you mean and ugly for me to fall asleep oh yeah but well, so's your old lady <laughs> um hmm. all right fine we'll come back here <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> Oh, somebody's whispering at us. Hey, you! Come over here. All right, let's go into this dark alley, shall we? Hello? Anybody <coughs> in there? Hello? You know, bad things could happen to a person in a dark, deserted alley like this one. Recognize the voice? And at this time of night. Nobody would be around to see it. Um. Ooh, issuing a threat right back at you. Yeah, and bad things happen to people who sneak up on other people from behind. So, you're going to give me a little attitude, huh? I'd better get your name. <laughs> I'm Guybrush Threepwood, and I'm a mighty pirate. Listen, Peepwood. Threepwood. Guybrush Threepwood. Well, whatever your name is, listen. Uh -huh. I'm the sheriff around here. Sheriff Fester Shinetop. <laughs> <laughs> this is a bad time to be visiting Melee Island. A very bad time. My advice to you is to find somewhere else to take your <sighs> vacation. Somewhere safer. Boy, I feel much better knowing there's an officer of the law around. Yeah, what an officer. Uh, <coughs> Alright, so you were on the train. And how long are you going to be in Kirna now, now? Oh, a circus. I love a circus. Yeah, we can't go anywhere. Over here. Just go back out on the street. And walk to... Why not look at the uh, church? Or chapel, or whatever. This is actually... Wow, well, no, I'm not going to spoil anything. Close the door. 
Yeah, let's go in, in here. Oh, right, wait a minute. This guy is the one with bad breath. You gotta get me out of here! I'm a victim of society! Not to mention halitosis. Ugh. Hey, it's hard to keep my breath minty fresh when there's nothing to eat in here but rats. <laughs> Talk to Death Breath? No thanks. <laughs> death Breath. It's locked. Where do I... I don't remember. How do I get... Alright. So, we might as well look at the poodles as well. No, don't, don't say that. Dangerous poodles. Look. Walk to deadly pir piranha poodles. I don't think I can get past them. Oh, just walk. I'm not going near them. <laughs> I'm not going near them. Okay. Fine. Alright, so now I think we've done everything we can do for the time being in Melee Island Town. Um, wait, 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 wait. Maybe. Hey, where'd you go? I hike halfway across the island to try and get you a reservation with the Swordmaster, who, by the way, says you can go jump in the lake. <laughs> and when I come back, whew, you're gone. See if I ever do you a favor again. Okay, that must be a must uh, must have been a glitch because he came back when I tried to steal the things. That was like a scripted event, uh, but he was supposed to uh, come on, come back husband. when you, you hit the bell. Ah, here we go. I could re really use a breath mint. I think that's because we talked to that prisoner. I could really use a breath mint. Whew, you're telling me. <laughs> Here, take one. Please. Take the whole roll. <laughs> That'll be one piece of eight. All right. What else do you want? <laughs> so, they had I like, like um, they had breath mints oh, back then, apparently. Best, fancy pants. Breathmaster, for the pirate who cares about first impressions. <laughs> okay. Alright, so we're basically done here for now. Uh, now we're going to leave leave the city. Um, the three trials. That's true. Hold it. Okay, fine. <laughs> yeah, they kept it re really authentic. Uh, um, they kept true to the original. There really is no music in this game, except for for at, at certain times, or and uh, certain locations, but. It's just so quiet, and it's 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 kind of more of an ambience thing. Do you ever wonder if we're all just characters in a novel? Yikes! Yikes! <laughs> oh, you almost scared me to death. I thought you were a. Oh, never mind. Hey, what did you say your name was again? <laughs> I'm still over here. I'm over this way. Huh? <laughs> oh. I'm Guybrush Threepwood. I came <laughs> to Melee Island because I want to be a pirate. Well, you picked the right place for it. Though perhaps the wrong time. <laughs> Not to mention the wrong name. 
<laughs> you have the silliest name I've heard in a long time. Okay. What the heck is wrong with Guybrush Threepwood? Yeah, I mean, come on. That's a perfectly good Nothing name. If you want to sell shoes, <laughs> you want to be a pirate boy, take my advice. Change your name. Uh, try something like uh, Dreadbeard or Six Fingered Pete. What? Okay. I'll just be off to seek my fortune now. Good luck. All right. Let's leave the city. <clears throat> now, the first place you're supposed to go, I think, is uh, the circus. So, let's go to the circus first. I, I, I always go to the circus first. And, uh, yeah. I mean, that is actually the closest place. So, I guess it's kind of logical. <coughs> I think there's something going on in there. Oh, really? I get in the cannon, but the gunpowder makes me sneeze. All oh, right. Well, I can do it. I hurt my hand taming the lions last week. I hardly think that little scratch compares to my chronic allergy. You get in the cannon. You don't have any allergies, you faker. You get in the cannon. No, you get in the cannon. No, you get in the cannon. Slacker. Loser. Ruffian. Flop. Weasel. Weevil. Miscreant. Tony. Nerdwell. It's so fun to just Scott hear Bob. them Mullet head. going at it. Millet head. Pencil head. Half head. Cheese head. Hobby. What? Just to get in the cannon. <laughs> no, you get in the cannon. No, you get in the cannon. Ah, your mama wears a combat sleepers. <laughs> Leave her mother out of it. Get in the cannon. No, you get in the cannon. No, you get in the cannon. <clears throat> Say there, son, how'd you like the chance? A once in a lifetime chance. To perform an amazing feat. A death defying feat. Well, not so death defying, really. Uh, dangerous feat. No. Not dangerous at all. <laughs> An easy feat. Easy. Exciting. With the amazing. Adventurous. Acrobatic. And exceedingly well known. Fabulous. Flying. Perugini brothers. That's us. My brother Alfredo. And my brother Bill. <laughs> Sound good? Bill. Oh, it's very simple, really. See that cannon over there? Yeah. All you have to do is get in the cannon. And we'll shoot you out of it. Across the room. Quite safe, actually. <laughs> so, what do you say? Uh, any good overlay page? No, I don't actually... Uh, I haven't used any overlays. Um, like, standard templates. For, I haven't used, like, other people's overlays. Like, this one I designed myself. So, uh... I don't know. I didn't even know you could. I thought like overlays were something you paid people to uh, to uh, uh, create for you. <coughs> I d I didn't know like if it's um, I don't know if it's um, um, if there's if there are pages where you can you can uh, get a hold of them. I don't know. Um, How much will you pay me? How about? 478 pieces of eight. That's a very specific number. Okay, sounds good. Have you got a helmet? Of course I have a helmet. Of course I have a helmet. <laughs> what sort of idiot do you take me for? Well, let's have it. <clears throat> we want to be sure that it's a safe. Wouldn't want you hurt. <laughs> no sorry. Well, the helmet is, in fact, the cooking pot that we uh, took from the kitchen in the scum bar. Someone cooked a head cheese in this. Oh. Ah, 
That will work as a helmet. Now we can do the trick. Step right over here, son. Now, put on your helmet. And get in the cannon. And we'll take care of the rest. Echo! Echo! <laughs> Uh oh. Ah! It works. Oh, I'm so relieved. Hey. Oh, there are. Are okay. you okay? What is that? Wait. What? Where's my helmet? I'm Bob, and are you my mother? That is actually a reference to Loom, I think. Uh, but let's go with that one. Where's my helmet? Is all right. <laughs> Hooray! We are spared an embarrassing and financially debilitating lawsuit. Here is your money, sir. <laughs> Just a recompense for aiding us. The basic theory is fine. We just need to change the aim a bit. I'll try it next. No, I'll do it next. <laughs> no, me! No, me! Slacker! Loser. Uh. So that was actually just that was the entire thing. Like that was everything you're supposed to do in the circus. You don't visit this place any anymore in this entire game. Even though you can, but you don't have to oh, come on, not again. Ugh. Come on. What happened? <laughs> oh, don't tell me. Don't tell me the game just uh, crashed. <sighs> and we didn't even save. That's just great. That's just great, people. That's great. Well, what can I do? What can I do? Nothing, actually. Let's see if I can use the task manager for this. No, actually, this is the same exact problem as I had with Outlast. You know what? I think I know what the problem is. I have my TV hooked up as uh, a connected monitor. So if like if I want to watch like movies and and things from um, from a stream or something, I can watch it on TV. I have it connected, so it like um, it transitions from that monitor over to that monitor uh, to my TV. And I think when my mouse cursor goes like w too far to the right, it goes into the TV, and that screws up everything. Crap. Well, we didn't get far this time, at least. I mean, I can always redo that. However, I think I'm going to have to restart the computer again. Because I can't seem to, like, minimize the window. Uh, here, let me, so let me show you. Uh, this is how it looks for me now. This. This white screen. This is all I can see of my game right now. Like, if I try to uh, switch to the uh, game nothing happens so I think I'm gonna have to uh, reboot my computer be uh, because obviously uh, apparently this is not like getting it's not eh. annoying annoying as all hell yeah maybe that was what happened with uh, with outlast as well all right, fine. Well, if you guys uh, have the patience, I'm gonna log. I'm gonna uh, restart the stream um, in a moment. I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna do this again. Although we're gonna try to skip, skip, uh, skip forward as, as fast as we can until we come to this point. And uh, uh, banana brain, are you with me? Are you? Uh, are you there? Let's see, because 
if I switch back to the game, it's just a black screen. All right, fine. Banana brain! Hello! Hello! Oh, okay. And Freppa, are you there as well? Uh, you guys heard what I said. I'm going to have to restart the stream. If you want, you can always uh, wait for me. Um, but if you don't want, I don't... Uh, I'm not going to nag or anything. Uh, but I think I have to restart everything. So, I will be back shortly. If you're uh, willing and have the patience to uh, wait for me, I'll be back. Um, okay? Okay? See you in a bit.